Well, you uh, excited to finally get it here and anxious to finally have a regular season game to play. Uh, you know, uh, I think my teammates and I can, you know, both attest the same thing. You know, we just want to go out there and compete and uh, compete against somebody, you know, who might not be your roommate, one of your friends, somebody you got to talk smack with, you know, after a good start or a bad at bat, whatever it might be. Um, I think we're all just excited to, you know, see some other competition and just go out and compete. How much are, are you guys who swing the bats thinking about the fact that there's a pitching staff that kind of has to find its way and maybe, you know, you maybe need to score five or six runs in the early going? You know, uh, I don't, I don't really even uh, think about it that way. Um, this spring, you know, during the fall, we've had some guys step up, you know, on the bump. And uh, I really think we, you know, we got a talented uh, bullpen and a talented, uh, you know, whatever the rotation might be. Um, you know, I just think that our pitching staff is ready and uh, also our hitters are ready. We've been facing off um, with each other for, you know, a bunch of months now. And uh, and I really think, you know, we have what it takes with the, you know, the pitching this year. Jacob, is that a change up? Have you noticed anything special with that or any of his other pitches when you faced him? Um, you know, I, he honestly gives me fits, period. Um, I don't know what it is, but uh, he goes out there and he competes. And, you know, that's a big part of, you know, pitching is just having confidence in your pitching. Um, and your pitches that you have and uh, just going out there and competing every day and uh, he comes and he brings that every day and uh, I really think you know all the rest of our bullpen and, and you know our guys that have started throughout the early spring um, have all had that mindset and I really think that's what's made them so effective. When the season ends in hopefully June, where do you think you will play defensively the most? Um, you know I don't know I, I've gotten as prepared as I can for you know first base and right field and, uh, you know, left field too. Uh, and I think, you know, any of those in the mix, I, you know, I couldn't predict, you know, where I'll be pe playing, but uh, I prepared and, you know, those two positions and whatever the situation asks, that's what I'll be at. Is it giving you clarity as to where you'll be starting out this weekend? Um, you know, we haven't really spoken much about it, but uh, I've been taking um, as many reps as I can at every position and just preparing myself for, you know, what, you know, Friday holds. You'll have a new guy next to you in center if you're playing right or left. Uh, any thoughts on some of the young guys you've seen? Um, you know, I think a, a lot of the guys that we've been putting in center, you know, they all have a lot of talent. Obviously, you know, you got guys like Drew Warden and new guys like, you know, Tadosio. Um, you know, he's he's a really talented outfielder, and uh, I really think he's going to be something special. And uh, I think whoever, you know, the guys are that, you know, platoon in the outfield or starting the outfield, I, I think we'll be in good hands. Are you more in sync offensively when you get to play defense versus DH? Um, you know, I would say so, you know, it's just something, uh, you know, as a kid, you grow up playing sure. a position, you go out and, you know, hidden. And, uh, you know, that was one of my biggest things this off season was just to focus hard on, de on defense because, you know, as talented, you know, as Clemson is in the ACC and, you know, everybody beyond that um, and every level beyond that, you know, defense is special. Defense is very important. And I think a lot of, you know, young kids um, don't believe in that. And you know, I was one of those guys, and uh, you know, I'm here now to attest that you know, it's a, it's a, it's something you got to work at, just like hitting every day. And you know, that's something I bought into this off season. And I really think you know, I've made some big strides this off season to a, get prepared. As a hitter, can can you go ahead and get a little excited about stepping in the box against somebody else Friday with a crowd, you, you know, and digging in for the first time this year? Oh yeah, you know, every every day uh, we get to go out there and compete. It's special. It's something we enjoy and uh, you know, have fun doing. Um, you know, we've been preparing for ourselves, you know, this whole off season and this whole fall. And I think it's something, you know, we're just all looking forward to is to go out there and compete. You think by the end of the season, you'll pull off the Reed Roman look? Is that what you're for? <laughs> I, I, you know, I'm going to tell you right now, you know, people have asked me that jokingly. I can't pull that off. That's only a Reed Roman look. But for right now, I really, you know, have the beard and the hair, you know, just to keep me warm on the moped rides in the morning to go into class. Yeah, but then bowler. Hey, I'm going to try. Why not? <laughs> Thanks, Ed.